I'll show you how to Frankenstein two priority mail boxes together because it is going to ship priority mail. If you do this trick, you're going to, and you're using the priority mail boxes to do it, you're going to, technically, you need to ship priority mail. But let me show you that. All right, if you need to ship something kind of like a little bit longer than what fits in these, uh, these, uh, you know, long dimension flat rate boxes or, uh, just the regular priority mail mailing boxes. You can take a couple of them and Frankenstein them together. The way I do it, I make it to where it's a little bit easier if you take a few steps first. So first thing, take your blade and uh, one end of it where it has the sticky part, go ahead and just cut. You're gonna crop that right off basically. Do it at like, do it on like the edge of a table or something. It's easier if you do it on like the edge of a table. So now I've got that off. Actually, you're gonna do that. So you're actually gonna do that to two different boxes. Now that I've got these boxes cropped, now I go ahead and assemble them. And we're just gonna be assembling one side because that's uh, the only side that is, that's the only side left. So go ahead and adhese, adhese that. So that side's adhesed. So I got one, I'll go ahead and get the other one ready. Okay, so then got my guitar and break it down, put it in here. And so now the cool thing about this is now I got this one you may have to bend in, just kind of flex the corners a little bit to where it'll fit inside. And then now you can get a custom custom length on it. So now I see the, the guitar neck is touching right there. So that thing is tight inside there now. And the seams look pretty good. Then all you gotta do is tape these seams right here. Now keep in mind, of course, you can't use the priority mail flat rate, uh, shipping rate if you do this, right? You gotta use regular priority mail standard rates uh, because you've, you've uh, modified the box.